After dropping the first half of the back-to-back -back last night, 4-1 to one to Bowling Green, Quinnipiac look to bounce back tonight. A better start, but a scoreless first period takes us to the second period where a great puck movement here from Tufto down to DeYoung with great hands in front breaks an 0-15 for 15 scoreless power play streak for the Bobcats and puts them up by one early in the second. Later in the second, Desi Birdcard gets room and dances the lone Bowling Green defender and picks the top corner after looking off the pass. A sweet move here by Birdcard for his first of the season. Bobcats up two. To the end of the second period, Burkhardt actually takes a penalty, which leads to a Will Cullen slap shot and a rebound for Gavin Gold in front, bringing Bowling Green to within one with a minute left in the second period. You always want to avoid letting up goals in the last minute, and we're going to see that here because in the third period, the puck's going to sneak out in front, and Brandon Cruz absolutely steps into one over the shoulder of Petrozelli for his second of the weekend, and we're tied at two with six minutes left in the third period. Two minutes left in the third period, De Lippertori steps up and is called for an elbow on this play, but he doesn't think he actually hit him. Take a look at the replay and see what you think for yourself. De Lippertori in the box regardless, and just five seconds later on the power play, Connor Ford gets lost in front for the eventual game winner. An empty netter to finish the job caps off a crushing loss for the Bobcats as Bowling Green takes both on the road. 4-2 the final in this one.